Hey guys, over here at uh, Free My Android, uh, another off topic, not very Android y, but um, the last video I showed you how to wire a dual um, coiled uh, 4 ohm um, subwoofer, uh, dual of them, uh, two of them, so, um, and we wired the coils in series and the woofer is in um, <clears throat> parallel, so that gave us an impedance of 4 ohms. And uh, like I said, this is what you want to do when you, um, if you get new amp, new sub, you want to make sure your um, ohms match on your amp, as long as with your um, your watt output for your amplifier. And uh, that's what I'm going to show you now. First thing you want to do is, uh, I'll have a link in the description below. You're going to have to download a, um, it's a 60 hertz tone. It's basically just a tone. Um, you just play in loop on your um, <clears throat> head unit. What you want to do first is you're going to go and turn everything flat. Any um, if you got any sub enhancements, um, turn it down to zero. Um, if you have any uh, EQs on, turn that completely flat. Like I said, you just want to tune your amplifier to where it's completely flat and there's no enhancements whatsoever. Alright, so first thing we want to do is go to uh, like Walmart or anything and pick up a uh, digital multimeter. I think I got it for like maybe 20 bucks, but uh, make sure it reads in... Um, all I really need to do is read in volts. And uh, once you do that, you're gonna. Oh, this is what I was saying before. I only have uh, one. Um, it's a single channel amp, and it feeds into just one um, side of the box right here. So that from there, it goes to one subwoofer and it's um, ran in uh, parallel to the other subwoofer. But um, just make sure you unhook both these terminals, the positive and the negative. And you're gonna take your uh, multimeter and hook the. Uh, Positive up to the positive, negative up to the negative. And basically what you want to do to match the right voltage is that you take your um, your uh, watt output for your subwoofer or your um, amplifier. It's usually better to go for your subwoofer so you know that you're not overpowering it. Like mine's uh, 250 watts. And you take that and you times it by the ohms and I'm running off 4 ohms. So that gives you 1000. And what you want to do is you want to find the uh, square root of that number. Mine is... I got it written down somewhere. It's something around like 31.6 something. And that's the voltage that you want to match controlling your gain. And you want to match that on your digital multimeter. And what you want to do is um, before you turn it up, just uh, turn everything off. Your bass boost, um, your uh, input level, everything just down. And set your uh, frequency level to around um, 80. And then... Um, Make sure the positives and positive, negatives and negative, and you turn it up to about 75%. And then you want to take the uh, sensitivity and tune it up until you get your uh, desired um, voltage output. Mine is uh, right around 31.9. And. Um, that's really about it. I mean, it's, um, once you get close to the number, little turns are going to be um, a great increase in the voltage. So just take your time. Make sure it's clean. Don't put too much if you have to. Don't put too much uh, base boost on it. If you can, put zero, like, none at all. I am at it like maybe one or two just because if I didn't, I wouldn't be able to hit my uh, voltage output. So just keep it very low. And um, that's really about it. Just finish uh, tuning it. Uh, rewiring it so where it's at a uh, forum load uh, matches my uh, amp perfectly and um, Now I'll give you a little uh, sound test. Um, so I don't know how my uh, well my speaker is gonna pick it up, but uh This is it picked it up but uh sounds very clean um definitely sounds awesome so um like i said just make sure you uh match your um 
your wattage, your um, your ohms from your subwoofers, your amplifier. Uh, take your time. Uh, don't cut any um, corners. Um, just make sure um, you're definitely matching all the right ohms, all the right wattage. Take your time. Um, don't go for that incredibly loud. Uh, go for that sound clarity, and you will still achieve that um, awesome uh, bass. So, uh, thanks for watching and subscribe.